Hey guys, what's good? Welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we're gonna do another speaker review. This time it's on the Yorkville EXM Mobile 12. Stay tuned. All right, before we get into it, make sure to hit that like button down below. And if you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe so you can help me out so I can make more videos like these for you guys, all right? Yeah. Now, here it is in all its glory, the York Billy XM Mobile 12, the bigger brother to the Mobile 8, which I did a review on. If you haven't seen it yet, it's right here. Check it out first and then come back. It's a 12 inch woofer with a one inch horn. It's basically the same size as traditional powered plug-ins, 12 inch speakers. It has that output. Um, maybe not the best bass, but overall it gets really, really loud. It gets pretty clear. So you can push this thing to the max. Just looking at it, it has a ABS rugged plastic design with a handle on the side here and also a handle at the top with the traditional metal grill that Yorkville is known for. It boasts of 60 watts of power. 60 watts? Hmm, I don't know if that's right because uh, this thing gets really loud. It gets louder than 60 watts in my opinion. But basically uh, the SPL is what justifies how loud a speaker can get. And the uh, SPL on this is 120 continuous. 126 uh, peak and what's special about this speaker is that it's battery powered and portable you can bring it anywhere and everywhere it's made for musicians bands you can use it as a monitor or as a PA fitness instructors can use it houses of worship DJs you can play it at the beach the park on top of a building anywhere and everywhere. You don't need power for this. That's the best thing about it. It takes three hours to fully charge and then the battery lasts for up to five and a half hours at maximum volumes. But at light duty applications, it'll last from up to eight to 24 hours. So pretty crazy. What else is great about the speaker? It has Bluetooth application, so you can link any Bluetooth device, mobile phone, tablets, laptops, Android stuff, anything that has Bluetooth, you can link to the speaker and you're good to go. Let's take a look at the back of the mixer section, okay? So here we are. Um, basically, it has three channels. Channel one and two both have combo jacks, so it's XLR quarter inch uh, connections. Line one is the mic and line channel. Line two is the mic and instrument channel, so you can plug in a guitar, a keyboard, whatever saxophone is into here. And then, uh, yeah, it's optimized for that. It also has phantom power for condenser microphones of 24 volts. If we use the XLRs with it, that phantom power comes out. Channel three is the Bluetooth channel, and that's the music playback channel as well. You can pair it any device. You hold the, the Bluetooth button for four seconds, and then you pair it with your mobile device and you're ready to go. It also has a one inch headphone jack, so you can plug in straight in hardwire. So if you don't want to use the Bluetooth, you can do that. And then you also have an XLR for music playback as well. You uh, also have some outputs here. So you can link out to another EXM Mobile 12 or any other speaker. Basically, you can link to another EXM Mobile 12 with one little XLR cable. And then this would be the right and then the other speaker would be the left side. So you would have the stereo sound. There's uh, volume levels for all three channels. There's clip. So if you're going too hard on a channel, uh, it'll start to blink red. Each channel also has effects that you can choose from down here. There's delay, hall, and room. Each channel has them. You can do the effects on each channel, do the intensity and depth depending on which effects you use. So that's great for, for music playback. And if, if somebody wants to sing and wants some type of effect, they can use that. Um, you also have the shape function. Basically the shape function is when you put it all the way to the left, on the music mode, the bass will actually come out more. Uh, it'll make the song or music playback louder and more round. 
and bass here. When you bring it all the way to the right now, it goes to the speech mode, which optimizes someone doing a speech or singing or some vocal type of application and it just optimizes for that. It basically cuts out the low end and it optimizes the mid and highs. You have the master volume here. You also have the battery indicator here. So when it's red, it's either dead or charging still. And when it's green, it's fully charged, right? So um, good to know and good that they have different levels so you know um, how long the battery will last or you can use it for. It also has the power button right here. Turn on and off, and of course the IEC plug. Let's test this thing out. Let's see how it sounds. All right, let's go. This is basically flat. Check, check. One, two, one, two. Nice and clear. This is a little more than 60%. Check, check. One, two, one, two. Okay, let's add some effects on this. Okay, we're gonna add some room. Put it on room and then add the effects. Check. Check, check, one, two, one, two, check, check. So it has a nice echo right there. Nice echo. Let's do hall. Check, check, one, two, one, two, check, check. It's like you're in an auditorium pretty much, right? So almost very similar. Okay, here's the delay. Check, check, one, two. One, two, 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 two. Check, 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 check. Microphone, check, 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 check. 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 That's, 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 that's dope. 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 dope, dope, very dope. Okay, now let's put it on, let's do the shape. Move it all the way to the right with a speech. So it's on speech mode, check, check, check. It's a little more tinny, so the highs and the mids are more prominent. As you can hear, the bass is gone, the mids and the highs are boosted, and uh, it's optimized for this. I'm connected to the system through Bluetooth on my iPhone. I'm gonna play it right now. Let's see how loud it goes. the sound test and review of the Yorkville EXM Mobile 12. Hope you guys like that. Um, a lot of pros to this speaker. It's a really great speaker. It gets pretty loud. You guys heard it, right? And um, of course, being battery powered, you can bring it anywhere. So that's the biggest plus. Bluetooth, having three channels instead of two. It's great, like amazing. It is a step up from the Mobile 8. I think you can do a party with this. A small party, for one, probably I'd say like 20 people, you're not gonna get that super bass response out of it, but you know, you can get away with it. The things that I don't like about this speaker, I noticed through the Bluetooth, when you crank it, the volume's up on the back for the channel three, the Bluetooth playback level, and then the master. There is that Bluetooth noise, and you can hear it. It's very loud, actually. But and you can tell it's the Bluetooth, because once it connects, it does make a, a noise. I don't know if it's just the speaker I got. It's a dud, huh? or a lemon, or maybe it's my location or something, but that's annoying. Once you turn up the music, though, it just goes away. 
And then when you turn it down again, that white noise and that beeping comes back. I don't know what it is. Another gripe I have about this, and actually the EXM mobile line, is that the battery is not user replaceable. I know a lot of you guys think this is a deal breaker as well. Yeah, it would be nice to change the battery on the fly when you need to, because 5.5 hours, if you have to go longer, and you know, you don't have power around or you don't have anywhere to plug it, yeah, you're in danger, right? To combat that, York Phil has a two year extended warranty that you can break it and they'll replace it. That's great for us people in Canada, but for you guys out of the country, uh, I don't know how that works. If you guys have to send it back here in Canada, or maybe you can do something with your distributor where you got it from, the store you got it from. But hopefully when the York Phil makes more speakers in the future, they will keep that in mind and make the battery user replaceable. Just a thing to note, <laughs> uh, it would be nice, right? Because uh, almost every other battery powered speaker out there well, the eight inch ones are all user replaceable. So it does make sense, but honestly, the speaker is awesome. And um, you know, Yorkville is quality. Uh, I've seen their work and I've seen how they do things. I've been to their warehouse and you know, oh, yes, they do Daddy. things right. And they do things that other manufacturers don't do. So I back Yorkville up 100%. Right. I'm a fanboy. I gotta admit, I love your fill and this speaker is another thing that I, I just yeah. you know, I hope you guys like this review. Please make sure to like and subscribe down below if you haven't already. A lot more gear reviews coming your way. We'll see you guys in the next one, okay? This is DJ9 signing off.